Hello again. Uh, this is Kyle Killam Art. I'm Kyle Killam. Uh, today I would like to do actually something different. I would like to show you some uh, some of the products I, I use uh, because I've recently had a little bit of a uh, creativity spurt uh, with some of these products that helped me finish up some uh, some paintings that were kind of just lagging and they've been around and I've been kind of fighting with them for a long time and they kind of, this new thing just kind of uh, polish them off. This is me showing Glico. They're my best friends. Alright, let's get started. I have brought this because this is uh, a small painting that has not gone anywhere really. It's kind of got a good foundation, but there's nothing special going on with this painting. So, um, it'll be a good place for me to, to uh, show you all the different things that could work. I'm going to really just play with this and use it as a tool to show you the product and maybe we'll get something cool out of it. Maybe not. Doesn't matter. Hey guys. So the first thing I would like to do is just show you the, uh, the little series I made with some scrappy old paintings that didn't really work out the way I had wanted. And you can see the amazing shine that the resin gives the paintings. Uh, they're quite small, but I think this could be a really cool idea as a big, uh, that's the wrong way, as a, uh, as a big piece too. They're, they're, but yeah, this is what I'm working on right now. I'm super excited by it. All right, so let's look at some of the stuff we're working with. All right, so here we are. These are just an assortment of my favorites right here. All right, hey guys. So let's look at some of these products. I've uh, set it up here so that we can look right at the piece and, uh, and I can show the products. I'm going to do the best I can here. So the first thing I want to show you is uh, the Gold Pilot uh, markers. They are just amazing. Let me get it focused. Great. I love this product. It goes on so dense. It's so amazingly gold. Uh, let's see. Let's just test it. I love this stuff. Great. Isn't that awesome? Okay. The next one, let's look at... Let's look at Sharpie Black Oil Based. Keep a lookout for these. They possibly won't be in your art supply section. They may be in office supplies, but they're amazing. So, uh, what makes the oil different from the water base is that it is glossy. Uh, and super, super, super dense. It covers up everything. Uh, in my search for good markers, uh, I came across this one because the density is really hard to find with a marker. It often leaves a sort of marker streak. Um, but I didn't want that. This is so dense. It's so black. I love it. One of my favorite products is this Sharpie marker. The next one, let's uh, go on to the water-based, and these are really awesome because uh, they have crazy colors. It's hard to find anything oil-based with uh, neon sort of colors. It just doesn't really exist. Uh, and it dries quite matte. I'm glad I found this product. The mark they make, it's, and this is also uh, this is water-based as well. I haven't used this marker much, and you kind of have to get work them in a little bit. The next one I want to show you is a really unique material that I've seen uh, Jean-Michael Bestier. I could recognize that possibly this was something that he used in his in his paintings. When you really get in there and look at them, um, look at it. It's made of wax. I don't know what I just did there, but isn't that cool? I love it. Uh, again, these are expensive. This stuff is expensive. You can walk away from your trip to the art store and buy five markers and spend 50 bucks. Easy. Easy. Close that. All right, uh, thanks for coming out. Thanks for watching me make this monstrosity. <laughs> I'm happy to show you some of the stuff I use uh, in my process. You know, I don't always just come out with things I like. Like, I really like this. I don't love this right now. That's okay. It's alright. It doesn't matter. Um, 
thanks for coming out. Remember to follow me, uh, comment. Um, so yeah, thanks again. I will see you next week for sure. Um, and we will be at a gallery, one of my favorites actually, but stay tuned for that. Um, see you next week. Bye.